Hello all and welcome back to the channel. So today what we're going to be doing is just taking a, a little bit of a look at Bluetooth. He's awake and how we would set up Bluetooth and pair it to something like a phone. Uh, so let's um, jump into it. So you'll see I'm logged into my FreeBSD install here. It's the same one I used in my Samba slash NAS. And uh, first thing we want to do is just make sure that the UBT driver is loaded. So for my Bluetooth, it uses the UBT driver. Now there are other drivers that it's worth noting. There's the BT3C. There's the HC Serial D and the SIO drivers. There's quite a few. It depends on what your chipset is for your, your Bluetooth dongle or built-in Bluetooth or whatever you're using. Mine happens to be using the UBT driver. So first thing we'll do is we'll KLD load NG UBT. And it can't load it because it's already in it's in my kernel. That may not be the case for you. Depends on what kernel config you've got. But we will just make sure it's in our bootloader conf, which it's not currently on my one. And we'll just reboot that pretty fast. So there we go. I can see it's auto loading the module NGUBT. Let's clear all that. Let's check that it's actually started, shall we? So let's do a grep UBT on var log messages there we go loads of it super duper next we want to start the service fully expect an error here there we go if you do it again it'll just start i don't know why but it does so there we go that's bluetooth up and running now we compare this with maybe a phone to make sure my Bluetooth is on, which it is. Okay. So let's set up the, the file for this. So let's CD into it. So etc blue, Bluetooth. And there it is. So HCSED. So we'll add in a, a device here. And you'll need your MAC address from your device. I'll blur this out so you don't know mine. Sorry. Make sure to put your semicolons in there. Ooh. Let's do this correctly, shall we? No key. Don't want a key. But we do want a pin. 
So let's do one, two, three, four. Super secure, I know. Oh, there we go. So that's how we do that. So let's just do a quick, quick edit to our rc.conf. Oh, come on. Which would be HC SE CD underscore enable. And then we want to want to start that service. So, Ooh. there we go. So, if I look on my phone now, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to click on the subscribe. Click the bell notification because that will tell you when I release new videos. And have a good day. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.